back at it. First of all, I want to preface this by giving a special thanks to all of my subscribers. I want to show my gratitude and my appreciation for you all. Very, uh, I'm very pleased and very happy to have you as a subscriber to the channel to where we can have a open dialogue, a community of men and women around the world. And, you know, I just want to prepare you because, you know, we may get an influx of trolls because where I'm about to take it, it might start popping up in droves. How much? Because, you know, the foundation of the, the channel, the very first video, was a poem about Mother Nature and how Mother Nature is the creator of the universe, supreme being. And we built on that logic and we talked about the power of the mind and having the ability to set your reality manifest the life that you desire and from there we went into the physical realm with the simulation and we went all through it and we showed how it's a simulation we proved it was a simulation we pretty much destroyed that simulation and now we're gonna bring it full circle gonna do the complete figure eight here moving forward building on that logic and I see the mind control at this point in the world is just, it's, it's too much. It's uh, over the top. It's a weapon of mass destruction. You know, it has the world going in the wrong direction. And then we can clearly see <clears throat> the blatant attempt to further draw a wedge in between man and woman and our creator mother nature and you know we see the complete disrespect with people walking around in nature with a face mask on and you know claiming that they need to be separated by six feet from the next man or woman just everything totally against what we were designed to participate in being together being one with nature being one with our creator and the one thing that I see that ties all these puppets together is religion and I'm ready to go head up with all of the religions so I'm ready to dismantle every religion religion that was created by man well not man but a boy a beast boy and a beast girl because we know we know the deal we know what's going on it's like you cannot call yourself a man or a woman doing what these people do these these are puppets it's like I've already went on record to state this and now I'm ready to elaborate further you know these religions you know they made them all up you know, it's now come out that it's clear. We know, <clears throat> we know who was involved with this. We know where it started. Okay, it's like it's time to go in on this right here. It's like any religion, anybody that want to hold on to the belief because they gotta believe in that shit because they can't prove none of it. And then we can see how they just basically plagiarized what was in nature. You know, they could have wrote a book on based on nature, all about nature. They didn't do that. They, you know, then they got the Nature Magazine. Like, you need to change the name of that. That's not the fucking Nature Magazine. You, you see what I... It's like everything is twisted with these people. It's part of their mind fuckery. Okay? And 
all these books that they made up, they wrote these motherfucking books, and then you just so happen to see that, damn, where did, where did they get the material for the book? Oh, they came from a tree, which came from nature. You see, that's not cooperating with nature. You want to take from nature in the dream world. You've been living in the dream world. Okay, this simulation, you know, they told you about the American dream. Okay. They told you about Nightmare on Elm Street. They told you about these things. Okay. It's just funny how they all got 5,000 different gods, but they all know who Satan is. Lucifer. The one that deceived the world. They know who that motherfucker is. They all know, they all agree on that. But then they can't see how that's exactly how they're being deceived. That's who they've been deceived into worshiping. Anytime you know who Mother Nature is and you know what Mother Nature provides, and then you're trying to tell me that's not a supreme being. Then you try to tell me that, oh, God made Mother Nature. Well, God is a self-created being, so <laughs> that means that Mother Nature created herself. <laughs> like, you don't get it. It's like, you need to wake up. Telling me about some puppet script mascot. Like, this shit is just like having a damn Burger King franchise, okay? You want a franchise, okay? The mascot for this franchise is the, the, the king. You want a franchise, okay? Franchise for this, the mascot, the name of it, McDonald's. Mascot Ronald McDonald. Same thing with these damn religions, man. Damn franchises and shit. That's why so many of these motherfuckers, like, when you know it's a damn, co <laughs> when you know it's one company that it all came from, what would you think that these was branches and a branch from the same tree? It was written by the same people. These are franchises. That's how I got to you. You you went to one of the franchises. Uh, you you went to go bur to uh, go buy some food from Burger King. You gotta buy this shit. They selling some shit and you gotta buy it. Then you go in there and they passing around a plate so you can put money in that motherfucker. Put money in the collection plate. Put you know send money, donate money for this and that, and all this kind of shit. Like you could be building up your own community. You know it could be a community fund for everyone to live in that area for whatever's needed. The money gets invested in all kinds. Of, so many ways where. Where man and woman could improve upon a the uh, the quality of life within this realm and and have it set up where everyone would be successful and will learn and will grow and you know stay in alignment to to do great things and become great. But no, it's not that. And the one thing that I see that's involved with all of it is this damn religion, man. They all got different religions, man. And they all think that they right and they better than the other one. And, you know, they're special for believing this shit. Because they got to believe it. They don't know shit. They don't know. Oh, I don't know, but I believe. Like, I don't respect that shit. Oh, you got to respect people who believe. No, I don't. So I don't respect what nobody fucking believe. Okay? I don't respect what I... What, I don't use believe, the word. It's a trick. It's a spell to even use a damn while. I don't deal with no damn belief. I either know or I don't know. Because, see, that's how you, you you get somewhere. You either know or you don't know. And then when you don't, when you admit you don't know, guess what? Now you can know. Okay? It's, like, it's time to go to religious anonymous and shit. Like alcoholic anonymous. You need to admit, you know, that that's some bullshit. And you've been tricked and you've been had. And you fell for it. And now you want to know. Okay, and then you can go from there. You can pop up with another one. To much you know that shit and you can prove it. Or you can get all the way with the logic and see that it's overwhelming evidence, okay, that the creator of the universe is Mother Nature. Okay? And it's going to be more proof 
to come that's going to be presented to prove that. But the proof is already there. Okay? There should be more people that are, that have a heart to say, yes, this is true. And, you know, this, that means, you know, this shows right there. This shows it. This shows it. It will be just, you know, the power of the creator flashing the brilliance to take back the power of the planet that was given to man and woman that they're giving away to some beast boy and beast girl.